What's up guys? <clears throat> um, today's date is uh, Wednesday, April 24th, 2019. It's 11.15 p.m. right now. Or, uh, yeah. So it's uh, 11.15 at night. And I just woke up a little bit ago. So uh, it's been about a week since the last time I made a diet vlog. Um, last time I filmed was on the 17th. Um, today is, uh, yeah, so it's been about a week. I uh, want to make videos more often than that. I wanted to film as much of uh, this as I could, but I needed some time to get my head straight. Um, I kept cheating on my diet, I don't know why, but the good news is it's been like a week and I haven't cheated on my diet unless you count like a quest bar here and there, but pretty much been sticking to my diet. So um, I I'm, I'm, I'm made that promise and I want to try to stick to it, even though my word not may not be the best because I've broken it so many times now, but I, uh, from from April 17th to July, or from April 17th to July 17th, I want to do this, guys. So I already got one week under my belt. Um, I only got like, you know, whatever, like 11, 10 left. So it's going to be a long road, but hoping I can do it. Hoping I can stay motivated. But in about a week, I think I've leaned out, you know, pretty good. So seeing some results which is good i was feeling you know a little fat last video i made but um this is where i'm at right now and uh you know i'm making progress quick but it's not gonna be really fun until i start getting to the levels of body fat where you know i'm happy with myself so i'm gonna show you guys what i'm gonna eat today and today's gonna be an off day from the gym my sleep is all messed up I uh, worked as a bouncer at this rave, so it really messed up my sleep a couple of days ago. But uh, it's going to be an off day from the gym, so I, I want to get in some sort of cardio today and stick on my diet and get done. So here we go, guys. Show you what I'm going to do today. Oh, yeah, if you guys are wondering, um, I did dye my hair black. I don't really know why, but yeah, it's different if you're wondering. What's up guys? So I'm going to try to go back to sleep for a little bit just because it's um, still so early, technically late. I don't know. I wanted to stay up for the day today, so um, it's going to be pretty exhausting since it's only like 12 o'clock at night, but I'm just having a quest bar because I don't want to commit to eating my meal number one if I fall back asleep but um, if I don't fall back asleep then it's just a quest bar so it's not that big of a deal so yeah just having a quest bar and then gonna go try go back to sleep for a little bit what's up guys so uh, I just woke up a little bit ago it's uh, 4 a.m. so um, yeah, got my first meal cooking. Uh, I was able to go back to sleep, which is good. So the quest bar turned out to be not a horrible decision because I didn't want to wake up and then go back to sleep without having any protein in my stomach. But um, I also didn't want to eat things that weren't part of my diet plan. But just woke up right now, pretty tired still though. Uh, I think I'm just feeling kind of drained from the cut and haven't really taken a day off the gym in a while but yeah gonna eat my first meal here pretty soon so i'll show you guys what i'm having in a second what's up guys um got my meal number one here um just uh six whole eggs five slices of turkey bacon and then i added a um 150 grams of egg whites for extra protein and then every morning i have 
seven of these Omega 3, 6, and 9 fish oil and flax oil and borag oil. And also I'm be having this diet soda. Uh, it's super bad for you because it has a ton of aspartame in it, but it tastes pretty good. Probably going to cut those out soon and switch to like stevia sweetened sodas or something because they're better for you. But this is my meal number one right here. What's up guys? So um, still just one meal for today and the sun is about to come up right now. Um, so I've been waiting for the sun to come up to go to the skate park. So now I'm going to go to the skate park, get some cardio in. I should be getting there right when the sun comes up. So skate park, cardio, check it out. What's up guys? Um, just got to the skate park. So I'm going to get warmed up and then I'm going to see if I can't get some footage or if I can get some footage. So I'm going to warm up, try to get some good cardio in. Just got here to the skate park. What's up guys, just got done at the skate park. Now I just pulled up to the grocery store, Stated Brothers. So um, I'm gonna get some groceries. Um, I usually come to Stated Brothers for a few things and then go to Walmart for like almond milk, Greek yogurt, stuff like that. But um, Stated Brothers usually has the best quality steak. So I come here for my red meat. 100% but uh, it's cheaper to get a lot of things at Walmart but sometimes like today I don't really feel like going to two stores so I might just get what I need from here but I might have to go to two stores because 
I gotta get some things from uh, like the health foods, like Sprouts or whatever, but I'm not gonna go to three stores. I'm not gonna go here, Walmart and Sprouts. But um, yeah, got some cardio in. Feeling pretty good, so. What's up guys? So um, just got some groceries while I was in the store. Had a muscle milk protein shake with like 40 grams of protein and I don't know hardly any fat or carbs maybe just a couple grams and I'm also going to have a couple of these string cheeses um, these are the low fat kind so only 2.5 grams of fat and 6 grams of carbs so or 6 grams of protein only 1 gram of carb um, but yeah so they're not really too bad, so I might just have like one or two. Um, but yeah, just little things like that. I'm allowing myself here and there, but uh, not anything big. I'd rather cheat on fats than carbs, but I don't really consider that too much of a cheat. Um, also, the uh, protein shake that I had had 40 grams of protein, so 50. So, having two of those will allow me to uh, catch my protein back up to where it should be. So, yep, on my way home, and then got some meals left for the day. I might go to fight practice later. I'm not sure if I'm going to be too tired or not, but I'll see you guys later. What's up, guys? So, just going to show you what I got here real quick. Just got this uh, string cheese. Got frozen berries. We got a bunch of different like vegetables, mushrooms, uh, green onions, asparagus, peppers. Um, got some energy drinks. Some Cholula for my eggs. Um, Greek yogurt. And then I got eggs and turkey bacon. And at the bottom of one of these bags, I got some steak. So, pretty simple. Uh, yeah, but yeah, this is pretty much everything I need. So, what's up, guys? Just eating my uh, third meal of the day here, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I forgot to record it, so I'm almost done eating it. But, it's just um, um, half a container of Greek yogurt and a um, little bit of stevia and uh, 270 grams of berries. So it comes out to about 50, 46 grams of protein, like 25, 26 grams of carbs, uh, pretty close to zero fat. So, um, I, uh, my macros right now for the last week since I started, week or so, have been, um, 350 protein, um, I think like 80, 70, 80 fat, 70, 80, 90 fat, something around there. Um, and like 50 60 grams of carbs now no day has been perfect some days i didn't eat enough so i actually ate less than i was supposed to and i didn't get certain meals in because i got too tired whatever um other days maybe i had a quest bar maybe i had an extra you know 25 grams of carbs but i think it's important to have a diet plan that you shoot for every day to get as close to it as possible but nobody's perfect and I don't think that anyone's perfect when it comes to anything uh, and in life so you're not going to be perfect at dieting but you do the best that you can and um, if you miss you know your macros 
as long as you gave it your best, stay focused. But um, I know something that I've had a problem with is, you know, maybe you mess up a little bit and then you're like, oh, geez, you know, I'm going to have a cheat day. But um, try your best. And if you mess up, you know, don't let that ruin everything. You know, um, I had a friend one time who said, uh, just because you drop your phone and you get a crack in it doesn't mean you should go and beat it with a hammer. And um, what that means is just because you mess up on your diet doesn't mean you should, you know, just destroy it. Oh, oh, since I got a chip in my phone, I'm going to break my phone now. I'm going to throw it and mess it up, which is kind of how some people and I have thought in the past, which is, oh, you know, since I was out with my friends and I had to eat one unhealthy meal, now I'm just going to ruin everything and just destroy my diet and eat all this junk. You don't have to do that, you know. Um, if you have a chip in your phone, the best thing to do or a crack in your screen is just leave it be and make the best of it. So the same thing with your diet. If you have a cheat meal or you mess up on your macros or whatever the case may be or you can't get clean food and you have to eat something that wasn't on your diet plan, that doesn't mean just uh, throw your whole diet out the window. So just something I was thinking about, but um, yeah, just getting my meal in and I will catch you guys at the next meal. What's up guys? So I just got a text from my friend that they're um, doing some open like rolling jujitsu at the uh, UFC gym by my house kinda so uh, got some good cardio in this morning but I feel like I could probably get some more cardio in so gonna go do some jujitsu and then after that uh, I'll probably be done doing cardio for the day so gonna go get a roll in right now so see you soon What's up guys? Just got done with uh, Jiu Jitsu practice and I'm just on my way home. So, see you guys soon. What's up guys? Just got home and I'm just having uh, two scoops of whey protein with some almond milk, unsweetened. I use the uh, Rule 1 protein right here, which is pretty good. So, that's what I'm having for my next meal. What's up guys? Just getting my next meal in here. It's just uh, 270 grams of steak at least that's what's supposed to be but this is more like two, uh, 265 uh, but it's supposed to be 277 um, and some broccoli anyway I'm really tired I've been up since 3 a.m. and I wanted to go to sleep but I might end up going to Muay Thai practice because my coach has this guy named uh, Danny Bill coming to teach a seminar and uh, he's really good he was like a seven time world champion in Muay Thai so um, I feel bad missing so I'm probably going to end up and go but I probably shouldn't have gone to Jiu Jitsu or the skate park because I'm just so tired and it's going to be like three cardio sessions in one day but not a big deal I don't know. I've never done cardio three times in a day. At least I can't remember. I'm sure I have. I'm sure I have. But I want to see how my body responds. It'll be interesting. Maybe I'll wake up tomorrow super shredded. But yeah, I'm really tired. So I'm going to eat this and then start getting ready for practice. You guys want to do my vlog? Sure. What's up? Is what's this up? recording or a picture? Wow. How are you? How was practice? <laughs> Dude, let me see those shins. Look at that. Dude, Ooh. look at this. My feet. Bro, all messed up. Some kicking Raul in the and face. Those whip pads. Nah, I'm just kidding. Oh. Raul, you, you got me pretty good today. You want to tell me what happened between us? <laughs> fucking throw me on the ground. I mean, I feel like it, it, it was pretty. Yeah. We, got, we got closer to each other. Yes, today. we did. Yeah. Very close. Yeah, but it was a good practice. Uh, the guy in the background is a seven time uh, Muay Thai world champion, so just got done with practice. About to go home. Third workout of the day. 
What's up guys? So uh, we just got done with practice. Uh, what'd you think, Chase? It was a good practice. Uh, we had a chance, I don't know if you let him know, but we had a chance to work out with Danny Phil, seven time uh, world Muay Thai champ. So our coach Jordan brought him in. Uh, I think he's from Cameroon, that's where he's from, but uh, definitely a bad dude and he was able to show us a lot of uh, you know, good technique, so it was a good practice, special yeah. practice. And for for those who don't know, Chase, what exactly is Muay Thai? Muay Thai, I believe it translates into uh, free boxing, so it's, uh, it's a type of kickboxing practice in uh, Thailand. And uh, it's like, you know, it's really big there. It's kind of like their national sport. Uh, they, they always fight in front of the king on the king's birthday, and then they fight all year long. But it's, it's I guess, if you go to Thailand, it's, it's like a major sport there. Yeah. So it's basically just kickboxing, American kickboxing. Yeah, guys, so uh, that was very good. Wow. I feel like you've been uh, studying for that question. Yeah, no, I was all on the fly. <laughs> yeah, so me and my brother, we, uh, we wrestled, you know, most of our lives. Um, and been thinking about doing a little bit of mixed martial arts. Not sure. Getting punched in the face sounds kind of scary, but um, after getting done with wrestling in college, I really had nothing to do with myself as far as like competitive, like combat type sports. So I don't know. I really like lifting weights and stuff like that, but uh, there's certain parts of like wrestling and stuff that I miss. And uh, mixed martial arts is kind of like that. So I don't know if I'll, maybe I'll just end up being like a jiu-jitsu guy or maybe I'll just, you know, do kickboxing tournaments here and there. Or maybe I'll try to be an MMA fighter. But haven't made up my mind yet. I'm having a blast. I think my brother wants to do a fight though, right? Yeah, I think I told Jordan that I wanted to do at least one fight. I said it was a bucket list type of thing. Yeah. So I've committed myself to one fight. I haven't specified the time, maybe months, maybe years, but I think I'm getting the itch to at least step into the octagon once and see what it would taste like. Nice. Yeah, so it was pretty cool. Um, pretty cool practice today. Had a lot of fun. My shins really hurt. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty exhausted. Got up at three this morning, so been up for a while, but gonna go home. Got one meal left. And that should be about it for today. So, catch you guys soon. What's up, guys? So, um, last meal of the day. Just uh, 270 grams of berries and half a container of Greek yogurt. So, it's like 46 grams of protein and like 26 grams of carbs, something like that. Got some Kool Aid. I take these little packets right over here and these are unsweetened unsweetened so I mix those with stevia and then I just make like stevia kool-aid which is pretty cool when you're trying to cut back on diet soda and kind of like stay hydrated too at the same time but yeah Last meal of the day. I have not done that much cardio and ate that little food in a long time. I had like 80 grams of fat today and like um, 50, 60 grams of carbs. And I did like six hours of cardio. So. Super exhausted, super tired. I'm curious to see if I wake up tomorrow and I'm just like flat and my muscles are just gone and like they disappear. Or if I wake up and I'm like shredded, just like made a week's worth of progress in one day. Because if that's the case, honestly, I might start doing this every day because hey, it's not the diet or I mean, it's not the cardio that's hard. It's like, oh geez, I gotta go freaking couple months without eating them, my favorite foods I'd rather just freaking do cardio three times a day and cut down the time that I have to skip eating my favorite foods in half so yeah but a good day really tired probably should eat this and get some sleep but 
I'm going to try to um, post as many videos as I can. Um, I'd like to get every single day up, you know, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. I'm going to try, but most likely I'm probably going to miss some here and there, but you never know. Maybe I'll get a video up every day, but at least I haven't cheated, you know. That's a good thing. So, anyway guys, catch you later. That was the vlog for today. Uh, successful day of dieting and doing cardio. So, feel pretty good. Hopefully I'll sleep good tonight. So, catch you later.